We are learning new details today about the man accused of being one of the most notorious serial killers in California and the country. KPIX 5's Jackie Ward is here with a closer look at the Golden State Killer. While this arrest is a major break in the case of the Golden State Killer, there are still a lot of questions about him that need to be answered. And all of a sudden, in a six day period of time, we've solved the case of the century. 72 year old Joseph D'Angelo, a former police officer, is now in police custody. Police say he is the man responsible for 12 murders, dozens of rapes, and more than 150 residential break ins across California in the 1970s and 80s. We found the needle in the haystack, and it was right here in Sacramento. While investigators still have not revealed what information they got a week ago that made them start keeping tabs on D'Angelo, they have said that a discarded item with his DNA on it is what gave them the break they needed. We started some surveillance. We were able to get some discarded DNA, and we were able to confirm what we thought we already knew that we had our man. D'Angelo's six year career as a police officer came to an end when he was caught shoplifting a can of dog repellent and a hammer from a pay and save store in 1979. Authorities are now wondering if those items were intended as tools for the crimes he's suspected of carrying out. Investigators are also trying to determine if he committed any of the alleged crimes while on duty or if his knowledge of policing helped him evade capture. D'Angelo will be arraigned in Sacramento tomorrow. Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.